On December 20th, Ariane Space launched a Vega C rocket. This is the new larger version of their Vega solid propelled vehicle with the Pleiades, Neo 5 and 6 Earth observation satellites. First, let's check out the launch. A tous de DDO. Attention pour le décompte final. 10 9 8 7 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, top. Allumage B120, décollage. La propulsion, la propulsion est nominale, le pilotage est calme. Now, all was looking good until about three and a half minutes after the launch, during the Zafiro 40 upper stage burn, it became apparent that the rocket was deviating from its target trajectory. Ariane Space said that they observed an underpressure on the Zafiro 20, I mean, the zero, Zafiro 40. So if you look at the trajectory graphic at the bottom, you can see that that yellow line is dipping from the target green line. But it's tonight that everything starts for them. This was Vega's C's second launch. First launch in July of 2022 was successful. Its little sibling, the Vega rocket, has also traveled a rough road as well, experiencing two failures in three launches in 2019 and 2020. This means Italy-based Avio is the primary contractor for the Vega series. Ariane Space and the European Space Agency announced that they will establish an independent inquiry commission to investigate the failure, which resulted in the loss of both satellites. Although, since the panel will be chaired by ESA's Inspector General and Ariane Space's Chief, Chief Technical Officer, I wonder if independent is really an accurate description, so long as they're honest, thorough, and pull no punches. Now, hopefully they get to the bottom of it and... Uh, uh, Avio fixes whatever is wrong. The graph in front of us, we can see that the trajectory, it seems to be going, maybe, is it going off course? Can you tell me? Oh, yes, it is going off course. Yes, 